Hi guys, Kishore here. So today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to subtract decimals. Last time I taught you how to add decimals and what's the meaning of a decimal. In case you forgot, let's I'll just tell you what a decimal is again. A decimal is a special type of fraction. Okay. First, I'll start off with an e easy question. Okay, let's do like... Nine. Okay. So this one is a two digit decimal. This one's a one digit decimal. Because I'm telling that because the after the decimal there's one digit and after the decimal there's two digits in this one. Okay, now let's put it now um now let's line up these decimals yes. but to make it easier whenever there's a missing number we can put zero there's a missing number over that so we can put zero so now we just need to subtract it one second. So, do you know how I put the 3.25 in the bottom? I put the 3.25 on the bottom because that's a takeaway number. After the takeaway sign, there's 3.25. That's why I put it on the bottom. Okay. Take your over. 10 minus 5 is 5. And then 3 minus 2 is 1. 4 minus 3 is 6. So 6.15 is the answer. Okay. The next one is going to be a little harder. Okay. I think you notice one difference. Now, the 7 is a whole number. There's no decimals. So this is going to be a little harder. Okay. We have to do the same thing. We have to align it like together. So 7 minus 6.81. There's no decimal. So we can just copy the dec that decimal and put it right beside the seven. So that's gonna be a little bit easier. See, I told you in this one, if there's no number, we can put a zero. Sorry. Okay. So we can carry over. 10 minus 1 is 9. There's a 9 minus 8 is 1. Oh, because we took that one. 6, 0. Sorry. 6. 6 minus 6 is 0. So the answer is going to be 0 0.19. So that's how we subtract decimals. I hope you enjoyed this lesson and I hope you understood it. Thank you.